evade that were flown in on private charter airplane. Human stories from relatives across that vast region focused on the tragic lack of aid, especially within the vast interior parts of that island. Our district has the largest concentration of Puerto Ricans in Ohio, and families are very worried. FEMA is not doing its job, and the Trump administration should get F for all the citizens of this country that are being left behind. Victor Leandri of the Lorraine-based nonprofit El Centro noted that his brother and sister-in-law live in a smaller city, Ponce, and as of this weekend, they still had no power. I asked consent to insert into the record a letter from a constituent's family member detailing a dire situation. No water, no electricity, no radio uh, contact with families' life savings destroyed, their crops and their land as well. Time's expired without We insertion. need to address the humanitarian crisis in Puerto Rico. What is happening there Time's is un-American. The Trump administration better wake up and help the citizens of this country. Gentleman's I time's expired. Back. For what purpose does the gentleman from New York seek recognition? Uh, the question is, one minute and to extend my remarks. Objection. The gentleman is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise today to recognize an outstanding constituent and volunteer firefighter from the 22nd District, Neil Sutherland, otherwise known as Suds. Neil has been a member of the Stittville Volunteer Fire Department since 1965 and Fire Chief since 1998. Throughout his 53 years of dedicated fire service, Chief Sutherland